Hi, my name's Ingemar Hunnings, and I just wanted to uh, explain in this podcast what qualifying work experience, QWE, uh, as it's commonly called, uh, actually is. Um, <clears throat> so the SRA, Solicitors Regulation Authority, uh, who which regulates solicitors in England and Wales, has brought in a new way for uh, people to qualify as uh, solicitors, uh, which is taking over from the LPC route. And uh, so to explain what qualifying work experience is, uh, which is the uh, element that's really replacing and really quite different from the um, uh, from the uh, requirement for a training contract. Uh, so qualifying work experience needs to be two years full time equivalent. Notice that's two full years but it's full-time equivalent. So you could be working part-time and then add up the part-time to make the two years. It can be obtained in up to four different organisations, but no more. Um, but it could be just one organisation, that's fine. It could be for more than two years, that's fine. It has to be real-life experience in uh, the provision of legal services. Now, the SRA have not defined what... Uh, legal provision of legal services is so that is down to the opinion of the confirming solicitor now the qwe needs to be confirmed by a solicitor regulated by the sra they don't need to have a current practicing certificate and if there is a solic no solicitor in the organization in which you are uh, working to do your qwe you are allowed to reach out to an external uh, solicitor uh, and I do provide that service. So other things to note about the QWE, um, it does not need to be in English law. It does not need to be in a law firm. It does not even need to be in the UK. I've helped people from Hong Kong to Israel to Belgium, just to mention a few color, uh, countries. Um, <clears throat> and it, also it doesn't need to be paid. It can be voluntary. And even uh, the SRA give the example of the citizen's advice. OK, as I mentioned, it does need to be confirmed by a, a uh, solicitor. Um, and uh, what else can I say about the QWE? Um, if you're not sure if the work that you're doing is going to qualify as QWE, then ask the confirming solicitor because they will have to make that confirmation to the, uh, the SRA. Uh, and it's their judgment, which ultimately the SRA if they ever want to see any evidence, will be uh, calling upon there. OK, <clears throat> so um, I hope that's helpful. If you uh, found this helpful, then please do share and uh, like and uh, comment on this. Uh, and uh, just to say that if you don't have a uh, solicitor in your organisation who can confirm your qualifying work experience, then uh, I can help with that. My details, Ingemar Hunnings. Uh, so email is Ingemar, I-N-G-E-M-A-R, at Hunnings Consultancy, H-U-N-N for November, I-N-G-S Consultancy.co.uk. It's probably the easiest. Or find me on LinkedIn. There's only one person with my name on LinkedIn. Thank you. Goodbye.